About two years ago, we became aware of the Hewlett Packard T485 press. Actually, it was the T480 490 press, and uh, started looking into it and found out that it could get really close to what we needed it to do. So we started talking to several vendors. Uh, Hewlett Packard is the one who had the thing that was the, the machinery that was closest to what we needed. And they assured us that they could migrate this platform to what they call their brilliant inks, which gives us that intense color that we need for a high school or elementary school textbook. So we found a place in our facility. We poured an eight inch slab to fit underneath the press. Uh, each of these print engines is 11,000 pounds and there's some vibration. So we had to have the concrete floor strong enough to be able to support the entire structure. And over the course of about six months, we did site preparation. It took uh, about nine months for us to order the press until it was finally delivered. And the installation process, we actually had to put the Mueller Martini uh, bindery equipment in before we put the press in, which is unusual because there was no way to get it past all of this equipment so that we could install the bindery. There's only two setups like this in the world, and this is the only one that is actually currently running. The other one is in France. This is the only one in the Western Hemisphere that's set up to run directly from a roll of paper to a finished book in one process without anybody else touching it. About two million students a day use our product. We are in most of the Christian schools in the United States, and we have tens of thousands of people using our homeschool product. Uh, it's definitely more efficient. It can increase our productivity from the press about 300%. We'll turn out a 700-page book from a roll of paper to a finished book with a cover in six and a half seconds. Well, the, the Conti web, which is at the end of the press here, is loaded with two rolls of paper. And as, as the one is being used, there's an accumulator over the top. When this roll gets down to a certain size, the other roll splices in and spools up. And while it's doing that, that accumulator is shrinking and all that paper is going through so that at 800 feet a minute, we can go from one roll to the next without slowing the press down. I feel great. This is very exciting for me, having my experience in the, in the printing, printing business. And we're really looking forward to what this can do in the future, not only for BJU Press, but for our customers.